Hey, what's up guys and welcome back to Ask NK. So if you're one of these artists that want to improve the way they sculpt, or maybe you're trying to get into sculpting, then probably this news is for you. So there is a yearly event that actually happens, which is called Sculpt January. And Sculpt January is made, you know, available and possible by the guys at CG Boost. Actually, it's just one guy. So you might have recognized this guy as Zach, one of the good guys that actually works with Blender and does amazing sculpts with it. So he came up with this idea a few years back and ever since then it has been an amazing journey for almost every artist that has actually you know try to do these things so in case you want to get into sculpting this is like the best time more like what we have with november and the same things that we have for inktober this is sculpt january and this year's sculpt january is going to be starting off from the 1st of january all the way to the 31st of january in 2020 and it's really good to see that we have about 31 days which you can use to learn how to sculpt things actually the entire idea about this thing is so that you can get or improve your skills in terms of sculpting and you have about six different topics that you can cover and you have about five individual objects that you can sculpt within these topics and i kind of think that this is one of the things that you know would help the artist and help everyone that wants to get into sculpting you know polish their skills a bit more and if you want to draw inspirations from this you can also come down here and you can see some inspirations from last year other things that you need to know is if you're joining the sculpt january you may want to actually post your images with the hashtag like scop january 2020 or maybe just using scop january as well some other thing to keep in mind is you actually don't have any form of limitation when it comes to software of choice so if you want to work with 3d code blender modbox zbrush whatever you want to work with it's totally up to you and you can choose to render these things if you want but that is not the idea here and of course you can also choose to throw in materials and textures but at the same time that is really not the idea and you can also go ahead and join the social media outlets so that you can get both updates inspiration and probably feedback when you're working on your model you can also find a couple of free resources on this page and at the same time if you want to join this cup january you can simply download this which would give you a zip file and within the zip file you can find you know the prompts which are the things that you need to do and at the same time you can find the logo which you can attach to your renders and it's really good to see that artists are coming out with things like this that is definitely going to help other artists to get better at their craft and that's about it guys i would like to know what you guys think about this in the comment section and if you found this video informative or helpful go ahead and give it a like and don't forget to turn on notification and if you're new here it's going to be amazing if you can hit the subscribe button and also turn on notifications so that you don't miss the next video or the next update and until I see you guys again with a tutorial update, free Friday, tutorial Tuesday, tips and tricks, things like this. Peace.